and I'm live. All right. So I'm going to use the same. I'm going to use the uh, the session I'm using. I'm going to my Punk My Friends session. I'm going to think I'm going to do all the Punk My Friends songs in one session, one Ableton session. So that's going to be crazy. That's going to be crazy. But I'm going to try it. So I'm just going to do a quick, quick, uh, um, do that quickly. And then I'm going to go record some drums tonight. So first things first is we want to get the, get the MP3. So I'm going to download it. I'm going to buy it. I'm going to buy it on iTunes. Classic. Classic old iTunes buy. And then I'm going to import it into Ableton. And then I'm going to find the tempo. So let's do this. We'll go to store. Matt Gun Dust. Boom. Library. I mean store. Yeah, there. Go. Go. Store. No suggestions for Matt Gun Dust in store. There. Come on. Let's go. There it is. Right there. Great. Yep, buy it. Type in my password. Incorrect password. Let's go. Let's go. Awesome. So, here we go. Downloading. All right. Okay. See if I can just drag it on. No, not yet. Uh, let's go to library. Matt Gun. Matt Gun. Dust. Boom. Drag it in here. There we are. Right off the bat, I'm going to collect all and save to make sure that the MP3 is in the session. There we go. I'm actually going to text Matt Gun and see if he has the tempo off by heart for dust. See if he remembers real quick while I'm doing this. Otherwise, I'll just find it. Actually, it's a good exercise just to find it. Or, f yeah, find it or create one that's really close if you didn't record to a click. But I will ask him for fun as I'm trying to find it. Matt Gun. Hey, dude, what is... <clears throat> Did you record dust to a click? Oh, come on. All right. While my computer decides to stop freezing, I will do this here. <laughs> I've got it in the, in the kick drum track. That's not going to work. All right, let's see here. So, okay. Yo, right? Oh yeah, three, uh, three um, streams. Oh yeah. Yo, Stokes, Stokes. Yo, Nicole. And yo, Stokes. Yeah, I've been running around, and now I'm just gonna come back in and start the next track. Yo, right, right. Just freaking get it going. So, let's just find. Let's just do it. Let's just find it on my own here. I'm gonna find out the tempo on my own. So what we'll do is, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, ma 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 ma, turn the click on. All right, 
he doesn't remember, but I will. Got to automate this click here. The master track, so. Let's go 62, All right, let's, I'm gonna automate that. So what the heck, okay, so, 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 so. Let's do it right here. Let's find it, oh man. Mm, this is crazy. I wish I was starting a new session because it would be way easier to um, do this if I was in a new session, but it's good practice. Let's do this. Come on. Scroll over. There we go. All right, so... Now, we'll go here and actually, shoot, I gotta go here. No, oh. no, no. Tempo, okay, let's go. at this really closely to see if we can get it okay no faster very close this might be it 134. One thirty four BPM. All right, so this is the first step, right? Okay. All right. Awesome. So, so cool. That's great. Let's just double check. Cool, so now it's great. So I've got it inserted and I think it's totally the tempo. Right? Yeah, you gotta check out my gun on Spotify and and everything. Yeah, it is cool. He's a great artist, man. He's a really great artist, so and he's from Uxbridge, my town. Okay, 
great. So what I'm going to do now is pick a fast tempo, you know, like just speed it up. So take this, and I go warp, complex pro, boom. And then I go here, and I go back to this. Yeah. That could be good. <laughs> 190 is a pretty good punk speed. That's what I did for the last song. So maybe that's just what I did for this one, too. Maybe 195. We'll see. I can change it on the spot when I'm recording in this. So there we go. So I'll start with 195. It might be a little fast. I might turn it back to 190, but we'll start at that. I love again. Well, try to love again. Nice man. It's a great song for punk. It's a great song to make into a punk song. And Matt is also, he's a pretty punk guy. He, uh, he was in punk bands, ska bands and stuff, so he draws a lot of influence from that. All right. So, yeah, I'm just going to save it, and I'm going to stop this stream because that's it for this part of it, and I'm going to go to part two, and I'm going to be drum recording in a few minutes. So hopefully you're around, you log back on, and uh, see some drum recording. All right? All right, we'll catch you in a few minutes.